Here comes the cutback. Ryan fell down at the 40. Did Ryan just go down? That was a beautiful thing, wasn't it? All right, Matt, tell me, were you trying out a new dance step, or was <laughs> that like the turf monster got you on the block attempt? Yeah, that turf monster definitely got me. <laughs> Rather than throw the block, just I'm going to sit down right here. I really haven't heard the end of it since. When we win, and if something funny like that happens, it's okay. Well, and you made the facial expression. <laughs> is that it? Did I do yeah, it? I think you nailed it. Um, the reason I did it, so when I got up, and I saw both our backup quarterbacks pointing at me laughing, and then I kind of made the face and was like, listen, man, I tripped. And I didn't realize it looked as bad as it did, so uh, it was pretty funny. The cameras catch everything. Yeah, they really do. Falcons had a great start to last season. Started 5-0, and but then things went south. So let's go back to last season. What part of that almost was you just getting used to the new system? I think part of it is that, you know, obviously there's an adjustment period. For me, I spent seven years in the same system. And when Kyle came in, obviously things were a little bit different. And so that takes time. You know, when you learn a new system, there's a lot of translation that goes on in your head. It's basically like, you know, translating from English to Spanish. When you can eliminate the translation process as a quarterback, that's when you really start to feel comfortable. I feel like I'm a lot further along this year with that than I was last year. Looks left, pumps, throws, Jones at the 10, 5, and he'll score. Holy cow! Are you kidding me? Julio Jones is arguably one of the best receivers in the game. Just one catch the other night. He doesn't seem like a guy, though, that's going to be, you know, upset and complain or, or pout, but do you ever see that from him? Who's one of the most unselfish people you'll ever be around? And when you have superstars that way, it makes for a great chemistry and a great team environment. You got to understand, too, it's about winning. And that's what Julio Jones is about. He was about that when he was in college at Alabama. He's been about that since he got here to Atlanta. So two and one, uh, two big road victories, including in the division. How excited are you to get back on the field and keep this thing rolling? I think everybody is. You know, obviously, uh, division games are always a lot of fun to be a part of because you know your opponent, they know you, and I feel like these games always come down to players. You know, it's about making the four or five critical plays in a game to, to change the outcome. So